The fully automatic polar type testing unit has been designed for the execution of puncture tests on disc-shaped plastic specimens. The testing unit consists of the following single components. The robot for the specimen transport to the different stations. The specimen magazine for 240 specimens. The temperature chamber from minus 60 to plus 60 degrees Celsius, including interim magazine. And the high-speed testing machine with gripping device and disposal of specimen remains. A specimen follows the following course. In the first step, the operator sorts the specimens at the back of the magazine into their appropriate specimen places. Then the test series data is entered into the computer by the operator. As an alternative, this data can also come automatically from a higher order host computer. The unit is started by pressing the button on the operator panel. The robot takes the first specimen from the magazine. According to the requirements, the specimen is transported to the temperature chamber or directly to the testing machine. In the temperature chamber, the specimens are either cooled or heated. An individual sojourn time can be specified for every specimen. For the test, the specimen is put on a feeding device, shifted into the working area of the machine and gripped there. Immediately afterwards, the test is performed. A stamp, which is fitted with a force sensor, punctures the specimen at a defined speed, the maximum being 12 meters per second. Here, a force of 20 kilonewtons can be applied. The specimen is disposed of after the end of the test. Here, the carrier opens up and the specimen falls onto a conveyor belt. At the end of the conveyor belt, the specimen slides onto a pane of glass. There a picture is taken, with the help of which the fracture can be optically evaluated later. Then the specimen is ultimately thrown away into a container. Several specimens are run in parallel within the system. In extreme cases, one specimen can overtake another one within the system. This has a positive effect on the rate of tested specimens. Apart from the graph determined by the punctured test, a picture of the specimen is saved. As they are clearly assigned to one another, it is possible to draw additional conclusions concerning the material properties if necessary. Due to the arrangement of the devices in a circle with the robot at its center, enlargement is possible at any time. For example, it is no problem to integrate a barcode scanner. With the test system, manual testing is possible at any time. There is no need for retraining as for both manual as well as automatic operation. The software Test Expert is used for the control of the testing machine. Due to the high repeatable accuracy of the automatic testing system, subjective influences are excluded. In the case of manual tests, these can have a negative influence on the quality of the test results, for example, because of different users. The traceability of the testing conditions according to DIN ISO 9001 is guaranteed. With the SVIC software Auto Edition 2, an automating module is used which meets the most modern technical requirements. Due to the low test costs per specimen, a testing unit with automatic specimen feed pays for itself within a period of about two years. SVIC Intelligent Testing